What was the other one called? Old Altus Tunnel. <laughs> this is Altus Tunnel. Okay. Was it just the one place to jump off? It was one there. Was there anywhere else? Oh, I saw. It's like that ledge, but there's nothing. Oh. I don't think there's anything to get up there, is there? Sure. That works. <laughs> okay. Boop. Greetings. Runark. Okay. Still have yet to use any of those. Maybe we should do that at some point. Could this be a necessary item? That's a six. We No, that's a five rather. We're looking for a six. We're looking for two sixes, in fact, for the next upgrade. You ain't drilling me, buddy. I drill you. I forgot these little guys existed. The ice snails. <laughs> Crystal darts. Okay. Ah, pickle. What is with all the pickle comments? Giant pickle? Seems angry. Does he know how to get here? He does. Okay. <laughs> hey, bro. You tried. Marionette soldier bird helm. Metal helm formed in the likeness of the face of a bird, worn by avionette soldiers. Crafted to serve the sorcerers. The construction of this helm is remarkably crude. For a doll, the only thing that matters is that it does not break. Hmm. Curious, curious. Fuck you! That was risky. I was one hit away. Wow, that was terrible. Raise the flower. I was one hit away from death. <laughs> Guess. The max you can get in this cave is five, it seems. It doesn't seem like there's any sixes coming. Oh, 
That's the way I came from, right? Yeah. Now, which way is the way to go? Is this the boss? Try striking, therefore weak ho foe ahead. Is that a Crystallion? I think that's a Crystallion. They're the ones that take no fucking damage at all. Until you break their poise or whatever, and then they take shitloads of damage, right? <laughs> Pretty sure that's them. Okay, what's the other way then? Strong foe ahead? Oh my god, what the fuck is that? Where did that come from? Oh no, it's one of those? I fucking hate those. I'd rather do the Crystallion. Ugh, those are the worst. Hey, bud. Wait, there's two of them? Oh, I didn't realize there were two of them. That sucks. Oh, God. I didn't realize I was taking that much damage. Holy fuck! Jesus, did you see my health? Oh, yes! Somberstone Miner's Bell Bearing 2. Nice. Somberstone Bell Bearing 2. I think we got the not I think we got the regular stone bell bearing one. But I don't think we got the somber stone bearing one, did we? Hmm. Well, uh. I guess we level. Everything will respawn, but like there's that fucking creature from the deep <laughs> in the in the next room, so not a fan of running in there with fucking shitloads of souls. So I guess it just has to be done. Sad though I am about it. How much? 32.6. So I need exactly 7,070.
3,070 to go. One thousand four hundred and seventy. One thousand and seventy. Which means six of these. And that should be good. Hell yeah. I can math. I can math with the best of them. Um... So the question is, endurance or vigor? I think it's. I think we got to keep pumping the vigor. I just feel like, I just feel like I have neglected vigor and I'm paying the price now. It feels like I just don't have enough at all, even though I have quite a lot. Okay. Let's see if we can run through. We've got 130 souls, so we don't give a shit. So, let's just fucking peg it and see what happens. Well, that went better than I was expecting. You are the actual creepiest thing. I hate you. I hate you so much. Can I hit you from here? Sure can't. Can I run up this? It doesn't give like, it feels like it's too shallow, but, or too steep rather, but like, fuck it, I guess. Totally can. Arsenal charm plus one. Hey mate, has he lost sight of me? The Arsenal Charm, I want to say, is the one that gives you more equip load? Is that right? How do you get up there? There has to be a way. Stone scrap, sick. Is it a different cave, do you reckon? Do you reckon two caves intersect? There's no way of getting over there from the top of here, is there? Unless I missed something pretty fucking major. Secret wall? No. So that is just like a completely separate thing that I cannot reach from here. What a horrifying creature. There was no way to reach it from through the boss room, I don't think. Doesn't appear so. I think you just can't get there from here? It must be part of another cave or something. Or you just cannot get it at all and it's just there to fuck with you. That is the second one of those we've seen. First in the underground city of Uld or something?
The one that's like one letter different from the city above it. Oops. Uh. Oh, it doesn't say. It just says ruined labyrinth. But underneath, it's uh the Ula. And I'm pretty sure above it said Ulda. Pretty sure. We got this Erd tree, right? I hope so. <laughs> I don't remember. I assume I did. Have we really been that side of the Erd tree? The Wood Folk Ruins, I guess. Hmm. I guess we travelled a little further than I realised. Just like directly ahead of me. Unless, unless this is also. Is it just bigger than I thought? I guess it's just bigger than I thought. That's what she said. Because, yeah, I haven't been over here, but I have been to here. Okay, so this is all. It's a huge area that is the Wood Folk Ruins. Okay, let's try and get down here while we've got no souls on us. Go down, 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 go down. Nice. Wrath of gold. You can't come down, right? No. Faith, obviously. Wrath of gold. 32 faith. Produces golden shockwave that knocks back foes. Superior Erd Tree Worship Incantation. Golden Shockwave. Uh, this incantation was discovered when the Elden Ring was shattered, and it was feared as a sign of the Erd Tree's wrath. Interesting. Coming through! Out of the way, bitches! That went pretty well, all things considered. So yeah, this is all part of the ruins, all these different bits. Is there another place I can drop down? I'm trying to look out for anywhere that I could roll into. Invigorating white cured meat. Hmm. Not seeing anywhere else I can really do anything with. This looks like a bigger bit though, maybe in here. The icon shield. And gravel stone. Okay, let's have a look at the icon shield. Uh, where is it at? Aha! Strength 22. It's the Erd Tree? The icon of the Erd Tree? Great shield painted with a divine scene. The recipients of a blessed tear from the Erd Tree. An item that looks back fondly on the Age of Plenty. The divine scene acts in and of itself as a sacred invocation, gradually restoring the carrier's HP. Nice. Weird to put that here. <laughs> You'd think that would be like a starter game shield. Like the, like the health talisman that I found. It's constantly renewing my health. Didn't I get that? Well, I mean, I did go to Kaelid. I can't remember where I got it from. It might have been Kaelid. In which case, ignore me. <laughs> now, is there any point that looks like it could be a roll down thing? Not seeing it. I 
am seeing a candlestick though. Oh, hello. What about over here? Man, there's so many ruins in this bit. Ash of War Golden Slam. There's so much gold shit. And Cookbook 19. Ash of War Golden Slam. Skill of the avatars who protect minor earth trees. Jump up high into the air and crash down. The resulting pratfall sends golden shockwaves in all directions. Okay. And cookbook 19, I think it was. Why do we keep the cookbooks? Was it a key item? Yes. Nomadic Warriors Cookbook 19. Sweet raisins and warming stones. Nice. It's nice. Right. There is a candle over there. It's... What is it going to lead to? Oh my god, there's another ruin. There's another ruin. How are there so many? This is such a nasty place. I hate this place. Fucking creepy ass dudes everywhere. Oh my god, it's King Creepy Ass Dude. Oh, I hate that. Is anyone else coming for me? Or can I, like, give him a little bit of a go? Oh god, it's a boss? Worm face? How about fuck off face? How about that? Fucking got him? Question mark? No! Shit. Absolutely not! Okay! Okay! That was unexpected. That was very unexpected. Why did I not have another flask? I don't remember using another flask. But I guess I did. Somewhat terrible. Oh, there it is. I was like, where did I put the thing? I don't know. Hi. You go down like a bitch, huh? Nice. That shit. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm one shot. I'm one shot with the death blight. Gotta just fuck off. Gotta just fuck off. I don't even know how far that shit reaches, but god, it takes a while to cool down. Wait, he disengaged. Does he get all his health back when he disengages? I have no idea. 
I haven't really taken on many world bosses like this. He does not get all his health back. Okay. Guess that's what that means. <laughs> when he fucking bends over. I thought he was stuck on the scenery. But no, he was getting ready to spew his guts. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. I fucking hate these guys. These guys are terrifying. <laughs> Zero out of ten. Do not enjoy. Guardian's Sword Spear and Guardian's Garb. Weapon comprising a long handle and broad blade sharpened from the hard wood of old trees. Wielded by guardians of the minor Erd trees known as experts in the arts of combat. The power of this weapon scales greatly with dex. Oh yeah? Greatly, you say? Scales at C, mate. Greatly, I'd say, is A or S only. If you're scaling at C, that's not greatly scaling. <laughs> uh, and... Fuck, what was the other thing? Was it, was it armor? We'll have to go through it all, I don't remember. It was called Guardian something, I think. Guardian Garb, there it is. Worn by the Guardians of the Minor Erd Trees. He's a Guardian of the Minor Erd Tree? In accordance with the ancient pact with the Erd Tree, it is said that their deaths led not to destruction, but instead to renewed eternal life as Guardians. Interesting. I'm going to kill this one. It's too close by. Feels too close by to uh, feel safe when we're doing this shit. Not that anywhere is really safe, but still. Oh, is this the... Oh, I'm under the Erd Tree now. Oh, this is a... This is... This is the boss. I didn't realize. I'm so used to the regular Erd Tree bosses. You know. The fucking actual large boys. I didn't realize that this was the actual Erd Tree boss. I see. I see. That makes a lot more sense. Okay. God damn it, why are you hitting that tree, man? Bruh. What? I can't believe he didn't get the fucking hit off. Terrifying, 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 hate, hate, hatred, disgust, anger, fear, confusion. Oh, he's getting ready to blow his big load. God, I hate this guy. Yes! No, 
I didn't hit him! Oh, thank God. Crimson Spill Crystal Tear and Speckled Hard Tear. God, that was terrifying. Crimson Spill Crystal Tear. Temporarily boosts max HP. Can be mixed. The resulting concoction temporarily raises one's max HP. Interesting. And Speckled Hard Tear. This is the first three that we've seen. Like, we've seen some doubles and we've seen some cracked ones and stuff, but this is the first triple. Uh... The resulting concoction temporarily re raises all resistances and heals all status ailments. That is pretty legit. That is pretty cool. God, that fight is terrifying. <laughs> that is that is the most terrifying fight in the game. I'm just going to go out and say it. That is absolutely fucking horrifying. <laughs> It's just so creepy. I just can't stand it. Now, I saw a candle around here, but I've completely lost it now. Because I got so distracted. Where did I see the candle? It was like somewhere around here-ish? There it is. I thought I had to just touch it, but... Oh, maybe it was just going to lead me to the mine that I've already done, so it doesn't do anything because I've already done it. That might be it. How do you get up there? Because you can't get up those tombstones. You can only go down those tombstones. Over here, I guess? So I'm there. Okay, so there's a path up and around here. This dead end. Dead end, dead end, dead end, dead end, dead end, dead end, dead end. It dead ends. Hey, friend. It's the Creepy Lady Club. They're back. They fucking love their windmills, the Creepy Lady Club. Hi. There's a whole lot of you, huh? Flowers on the door handle. I wonder what that signifies. Protection of the Erd Tree. Hello. Wait, was it an ash of... Oh, no, it was a spell. Protection of the Erd Tree. 35. Increases affinity damage negation for self and allies. Uh, for all affinities except physical. In the beginning, everything was in opposition to the Erd Tree. But through countless victories in war, it became the embodiment of order. Now that is interesting. In the beginning, everything was in opposition to the Erd Tree. Why? Hmm. And it's now known as the Golden Order. Or the people that follow the Erd Tree say that they are the Golden Order, rather.
But why was everything naturally against it? Poison grease, okay. God, it's so creepy down in that forest. <laughs> the worst. The actual worst. Okay, so we can follow it all the way around there. We've been up to that windmill. Let's go, let's follow the road. Let's try and find a site of grace, actually. I mean, these crossroads would be fucking perfect for a site of grace, wouldn't they? Wouldn't they, FromSoft? What do you think? Scream site of grace to me. Come on, from old buddies, old pals, old friends, old froms. Can I see any of the rays of gold heading anywhere? Come on, from. I mean, there's definitely not going to be one in an area with enemies. Village windmill pasture, eh? Does this message say Sight of Grace ahead? Yes, it does. Okay, sweet. Dominula, Windmill Village. Alright. Alright. Grace discovered. Lost Grace discovered. Okay. Well, here we are in Dominula. When we come back, we will explore the Windmill Village and the other windmill bits and continue on around. And, uh... Yeah, see, see what happens next. Continue our exploration. Thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed, if you could leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Share the videos around. Share the playlist around if you can. I would really appreciate that. And I'll see you next time for more Elden Ring. Thanks for watching. See you then.